I'm at Lake Colorado City State Park here in West Texas and I haven't been here since I retired which is over three years ago which is over two years ago uh, two and a half years ago I guess two and a half years ago I guess now and I used to come to this park quite often because I lived in Odessa and it was only an hour and a half uh, from Odessa. So if you wanted to get out in nature away from the city, this is about the closest you could come and have some hiking trails. So speaking of hiking trails, we are at the trailhead, which is known as the Roadrunner Loop Trail. Now this trail has some uh, very fond memories for me because I helped create this trail from this very spot. Uh, let's go down the trail a little bit. I completed about close to one mile of cutting this trail and um, then I retired but also the superintendent he um, about the same time he moved on to another park and but it looks like that the trail got completed and I'm happy about that and the total length of the trail is 1.8 miles so maybe I can do the whole thing I'm not gonna do it this morning um, I have friends coming today so the sum of the trail I mean we would cut through trees we'd cut through cactus all with shovel and hose and hiking for your health that's cool they put these signs in throughout too. Kind of wanted to come down here and reminisce. But I did create a video. That was a long time ago and I will put a link to that up here. I think it's called Busting the Trail. I think it's a cool trail. I think it had a lot of neat, like these rocks here. A lot of neat um, aspects to it. I love that the trail is so clean and it hadn't grown up. Yeah, this was one of our spots we could rest. <laughs> Pretty cool trail, I think. Boy, how fast we get to this point when you're using a hoe and a shovel it takes you a little while to get anywhere. <laughs> I love this trail. I'm gonna go up here just a little ways longer. Let's head back and make some lunch. I came back, one thing that I remember is you would have to, of course, hike your way in with the tools, your shovel and hoe or whatever, the snipper things. And you'd kind of clean the trail as you're going, but then you'd work for two or three hours then you had to hike back out <laughs> and carrying your tools. So I'm just kind of having a 
reminiscing of on the way out, having to carry all those tools and think, oh, it's gonna be a long way.